Caitlin Saxstrom with her idol, Annika Sorenstam. This for Birdie at the third, takes them to 10 under par. Began today, Fusson, the rookie from France, playing with her teammate, another rookie from the Netherlands, Davy Weber. They have to bogey all. Back to that penultimate tee time, Matilda Castron. And with Kelly Tan, her good friend. Oh, oh with friends like that. <laughs> oh, great. So they join a the tie for second. This will just be a soft wedge. Get up. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Good read. Really nice read. Tried to escape. <laughs> And they pull within two. Head on, sort of keeps moving a little. This is seven iron for Lizette. It's her, actually the first iron in her bag. It works. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Shot and then making the putt. Yeah, that will do just fine. Yeah, I was going to oh, say, unless, unless you only need one part of that. <laughs> That's true. They're oh. very... Very nicely judged. A good cleanup, you know. Let it go. And did. Another good read, another good stroke, another good birdie. Back to back, get some 13. Under par. Good save for par after being almost of the way over to the eighth. Difficult eighth. Scotland grew up in Australia. Karis Davidson, a rookie on the LPGA Tour, just turned 24, playing with Daniela Darkea. Oh, 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 yes! She went down on the to get that to drop. And a good round in this alternate shot yeah, format yeah. to keep them. This is six iron. Kind of in a burnt out area of the rough. Thinned that one. Kind of a straight, low, thin shot. Oh, to As they win. say, thin to win. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or at least a birdie. Maybe. That is a darn good miss right there. <laughs> okay, she's on the right side. I want to keep it just to the left of the hole. Or right there, it'll work too. Beautiful shot. Good chance for birdie here at nine. Hi. All right, left breaking putt here. Solid. Boy, that was a really nice putt taking advantage of that miss hit. Well, and just look at that scorecard. All pars and a birdie for a pair of players that likely have never been in this position before, holding the 36-hole lead, trying to get their... All right, Kelly Tan now pay off the shot. Castron hit in there, and she snuck it in the left corner. It worked. It's a nice birdie at nine. That's a tricky hole location to get to. It's been a nice move today for Elizabeth Sokol and this woman, Cheyenne Knight. And that birdie at 18. Gives them the best score of the day, a 66 on this par 70. One now for birdie at 11. So Pat Limp's ball come back, and there you go. Came back to the right spot. Nice birdie. So they move within three. Three in a row. Birdie at 11. Should go a little right to left, maybe. Oh, yeah, she knew it was in. Oh, yeah. And Van Dam gets them to 11 under. Short right's okay. Pin high right's not as good. Yeah, caught that solidly. Yeah, really good. Oh, good. I mean, that's that's exactly what she was looking for right there. Not much more she could do. Yeah, going to be a tricky up and down. We have to you have a couple options bumping it, trying to go up in the air. Par four. Left her last attempt just short. Oh, yeah, that's just just enough. enough. Yes. <laughs> they teamed up last year, played really well. Played well again. <laughs> Yeah, this is a much easier shot. Little downhill lie. That's a sand wedge coming in with a slightly lower trajectory and beautiful oh, yeah. spin go. Yeah. A good spin control too. Yeah, yeah. Off a downhill lie, coming yeah. to soft greens to be able to. Went forward, leaning that shaft through. Oh, that was magnificent. That's pretty good. Yeah. A little easier from there. If that had been pin high, that's a lot tougher shot. I saw some pretty yeah. tough ones. Uh, here's Sydney Michaels playing with Mariah Stackhouse. They had a great run yesterday to make the cut. It's been a bit of a struggle today, but that'll be a nice way to finish. Mariah says, I've got this.
But it's a six, seven, and nine. Make the turn at three under. Fourteen under total. Third shot at the par four tenth for our leaders. We saw Weber. Yeah, plenty of green to work with. Uphill initially, then downhill. Thought that would accelerate out a little bit more. A little. There you go. It's another good way to look at it. Got a par attempt here for Heiji Kang with Tiffany Chan. All right. Hey. Heiji, the veteran from Korea, Chan from Hong Kong. This pair has made a few nice putts in recent holes. 15th. Six from now. This is their fourth shot. They are kind of going backwards here right now. This would help. It does. Oh. Oh, All right. Sometimes the car's getting out of control there. Double back at 14. <laughs> Inch of rain fell. Tuesday night and Wednesday. This is the short 12th. It's Kelly Tan. Judge the spin beautifully. That to and that's like see how close she can hit it. Five. Oh, not her best. Yeah. Well, All right. yeah, it's about 20 by the hole. I don't think she's going to like that one. That was a little surprising. We thought she'd hit a little closer. Two way tie at the top. Too hard or tough on herself. I think that was one of the things early on watching her play in college. She would get pretty tough on herself. And I would bet playing alongside Lizette Salas probably helped in that regard. A 12 footer to save par. Okay. Oh, center cut. Yeah, that's a good stroke. That'll calm you down a little bit. Yeah, that first bogey of the week came at 10, but good save there. Thanks, partner. Save me. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you deserve a little back rub there. And there's no trees there now like there were when I was playing. Did you? That was in plenty of those. This is a really great shot. They missed the opportunity last hole, but that looks like a pretty good <laughs> chance for save. She thought she had it. Ji Kang, now 31 years old. She was a teenager. She won on the Epson Tour back in 2008. 14th year on tour and playing with young Tiffany Chan. And she go to the 15th. Yeah, Petlin for birdie here. Let's sneak up that leaderboard as well. It's going to stay online. It does. Nice cut. It's him to 11, just three back. Watch out. Lizette. Playing a good amount of left to right break, almost a foot. Well done. Yeah. That was not an easy cut by any means. They were three back when the day began. To be careful if it's not going past this whole location because the green kind of slopes away. And back over the green. This has a good line. Oh, really wow. good. How about that? Boy, are they relaxed and then half holes. A little right to left and straightens out. Yeah. It's just what the doctor ordered. Really nice putt. Absolutely. So that settles him down a little bit. To the left. Yeah, great stroke. So any questions there would have been answered. On their round. Back to back birdies like they did at six and seven. Getting their groove back a little bit as we go to 17. If you can for birdie at 17, did she hit it? She did! Great putt. There you go. It's them to 12. Location kind of like the back center part of the green. Pretty accessible. Very accessible. If you can. Castron, beautiful shot in there. Good chance for Birdie. Going to get the 13 under. Castron hit a beautiful shot in there. Uh, Woo! 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 It's them to 13, just three back. Just to ensure clearing the lip. Cut that a tad heavy. But it shouldn't hurt her too much. Yeah, yeah that's that's a good lead. Yeah, just to the front portion of the green. Long shot. Four feet, 18 paces onto the green. It'll have left to right break and a little uphill. She did. Yes, she did. Oh, are you kidding me? That's all poor and plant when they won. Making cuts from everywhere. Wow, what a putt. 
play this event as we said last year but Castron who cleans up for par was asked by Katrina Matthew the European Solheim Cup captain would you go try to play in Europe and try to win on the LET and become eligible for my team well she went not only to Europe but and uh, Cup Joe in her rookie campaign last year for 63 that's going to be the best round of the two days of alternate shot though 64 Salas and Jennifer Cupcho and their three shot deficit is going to be a four shot lead going into the fourth and final round tomorrow.